course, with our book readings. Yeah. Where are we at today? Like, yeah. what's up? What's All right. what's happening on in the world of paper? All right. So, I I recently read a book series, um, and it was called the. Recently, he probably started yesterday and finished it today. I started Wednesday. <laughs> Fuck me. Of <laughs> um. It's called uh, the Vixen War Bride series by Thomas Dosher. Okay. I think it's Dosher. Is that how you say that? That's how I'd say it. Yeah. Um, so, like, this wasn't one that blew me away, right? Like, this wasn't one that I would, like, recommend to everyone all the time or anything like that. But this was a good, like, eh, that was a fun read. That was okay. You know, I mean, especially for, because, you know, I like military sci-fi it stuff. It took my time. It I was in the world a little bit. and I was... You know, I kind of think it was written by someone who was into furries. Um, okay. Because it was all about the war that they got into with fox people, and with by fox I mean, <laughs> and by fox people, I mean they had fox ears and they had fox tails. Okay, I will give them props though, because it just wasn't a person with fox ears and a fox tail. They had it was its own race. Okay, like like so they had thought like into they didn't it. have like for instance they they didn't they don't have facial expressions like we do. All their expressions are expressed through their ears and their tail. Mm-hmm. Okay, so they gave they actually yeah. gave proper thought, and it was yeah they they yeah they gave proper thought to how this went down. So the general premise is that you know humanity's made it into space. We're started colonizing. You know, we started getting attacked by these some people. You know, and by these fox people. These fox people, uh, and they have like a proper name in 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 the universe, right? I don't know what that is. I can't remember. Fox people. Fox people. Um, <laughs> but. They, uh, they, uh, so they're getting into this fight and it's, it's general, the general, you know, U.S. military of like, ah, they can't fuck it us with us. We'll fuck with them back. And then they drop a meteor on a fucking planet and they fucking, the Fox people drop the meteor. They drop a meteor. They wipe out a city. The entire fucking planet is ruined. Right. And that sounds like North Korea actually doing something. And that's when fucking shit gets serious. So they come in and they fuck their world up, right? They fuck, they they occupy their planet, right? And this is actually where we pick up. We don't pick up through the war. We don't see any of that. What we pick up is at the occupation of their planet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And you're like, I don't know if this would be interesting, right? And so it's following this one captain who's taking the uh, the... The, the charge um, he's leading. No, this. no, nothing no? like that. He is being put in charge of one of these villages on a cob, right? Okay. Um, you know, he's like, you're in charge of this cob. You need to interface with this village. Their emperor said that they need to submit and take all direction from us, right? The fox is emperor. The fox is emperor. Okay. Um, they have one emperor. Their entire people have one emperor. Um. So he gets there, and he's doing his first interactions with these people, and this fox woman comes running out of the temple, and he finds out, you know, they still haven't figured out the language, right? So he has an interpreter, and she knows, like, a few words. It's like the eeks, the oohs. It's like the Star Trek translators. Yeah, They meet someone new that they never heard of. Yeah, they've gotten enough to, like, kind of converse, but not really. And so this uh, priestess, she runs out of the temple and she goes, I am responsible for all of my people's crimes. I am the one who ordered this. Okay. And so... Burn the witch? The interpreter sits down with her and she goes, okay, well, I interviewed her and she admitted to everything. She admitted to ordering everything. She oh, also wow. admitted to the bombing of Pearl Harbor, the assassination of Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> JFK, all yeah, this stuff. Yeah, yeah. So essentially what it is, you know, and I'm not going to get into the nitty gritty of why, but, you know, it's an expectation of because of her position, she is responsible for the community and she wants to keep her community She's safe. She's the liaison. She's the representative. Okay. So what happens is is that they go back and he's in in the expectation is that he's going to execute her. And he's like, "Okay, well I need to punish her." And he's like, "All right, so the punishment will be that she will assist me 
and and be near me and help me with things, right? So the interpreter interprets that, but the interpretation sounds a little weird. And so the fox girl bites his hand. Okay. And in her mind, that they're, no. they're married. They are that because that's how their culture does it. Mm. And now they are married. Can I bite your hand, please? <laughs> I know how much y'all money. Y'all talking some book talk shit. I know how much. I know how much money you make. I know how much money I make. Let me bite your hand. Real You're big. already married. Sorry. Worst thing is that their <laughs> their culture doesn't believe in divorce. They believe that once you're married, mm-hmm. you're done. You're like a penguin. It's not just yeah. I mean, it is for your entire life and, and then forever, forever. Yeah. into the afterlife. Okay. Into their version of the afterlife. What culture is this? The okay, so series. you're coming in. You're coming in midway through this, not knowing what I'm talking about, bro. I'm not gonna repeat it. Talking about a sci-fi book series. You know, oh, watch okay. the podcast that we're doing right. Now. Yeah, right now, and then you can pick <laughs> up on what I'm saying. But you know, that's fine. We'll bring you into this. So we know you just bought a TV because you broke yours because you throw remotes at it. Yeah, that, I like to play. That's tag. what happened. He played tag. He lost. <laughs> Point. Interesting. Interesting. I'm gonna. I definitely want to read it. Text me about it. I want to okay. read more about it. <laughs> I want to see what people say. I want to read into the lore. Because it sounds pretty interesting. It sounds like you could do a D and D game. Like there's there's a there's a lot like it may be <laughs> it may be some furry's dream, right, or whatever. But the fact of the matter is, is that they put they invested a lot of time and effort into giving this culture. Well, I mean, essentially the culture is like Chinese, right? Yeah, more or less. Like you get that impression. There's even like theories in universe where they're like. We think they may have like integrated with China and Japan at some time because you know they look a lot like their fox deities. <laughs> they, they accepted us, but but back to you. Throw you in 